Hey YouTube, do you happen to have a Ustream channel? And do you happen to find that the Ustream recorder down here eats up a lot of your CPU? Well, the new Adobe Beta Flash Player 10 solves the problem. You can download the plugin from the link in the video description. Now, let me show you how this Flash update has helped me out. So here I'm doing my live stream as I'm using, I show you, and up here you can see there's my processor right there. Normally Firefox, when I had Flash Player 9 from Adobe, was at about 112%, and now it's only at 39% while I'm streaming at 30 frames per second. Cam Twist was at 70% roughly, and now it's cut down to almost 35%, 32, 32.6, so that that is like cutting it down in half. My computer is running a lot quieter. Normally my temperature was running at oh, 178 degrees. I just installed the Flash Player five minutes ago and it's already cooled down to 158 degrees at CPU A. So the Flash Player 10 beta really does help out a lot. So anyways, I hope you take it into consideration and, and install this beta and try to give some feedback to Adobe because it really does help your computer out a lot. So, hopefully this uh, helps you out when you're using the Ustream.tv recorder. And once again, the link is in the video description. This is a beta, so it is not fully functional. You might run into a couple of glitches. Hopefully the Flash Player 10 will be officially released by, uh, I believe they are hoping, September. So, if you're interested in signing up for the beta and downloading the plugin, it works for Macintosh. I have not used it for Windows, but the Macintosh version has worked great. I've used it on Cam Twist, um, all of my Flash IRC clients, YouTube, Ustream, Justin.tv. It's working great. It's really helped out my processor. Like I said, Cam Twist has gone down almost half. Firefox, when running the Ustream recorder, has gone down almost 80%. It, this was worthwhile doing, so I hope you take it into consideration and install it. Thank you for watching.